somebody else. That air raid attack. Rodgers with time, and he gets it complete. His first of the game goes to Wally. Jaden Wally, who was the leading receiver last year. First down and five after the penalty. Good protection for Rodgers and gets it complete again to the 35-yard line, and it's Wally again. And the pressure off the edge as they come with it. He gets it out, and that ball is intercepted. Josh Job with the interception for the tie. There by Job, pressure coming off the left, and he just falls right out underneath it with tremendous eyes. They kind of clouded that side, gave him a quick jam, thinking he's going to potentially get the hitch, just not on the same page. That hitch converts to a fade. Third and two. Pressure on Bryce Young, and he gets it complete to Mechie for a first down and more. And with a blocker in front and Slade Bolden inside the 10 and into the end zone. John Mechie with a 46-yard touchdown. And what a job with the yards after the catch. And just threw an interception. With time, he's going to check down to Woody Marks. Woody Marks catches a seam and will have 12 yards and a first down. Down at the second level defensively, which is such an important part of this defense. Second and two. And keep it on the ground with Marks, and he'll have the first down. In against Ole Miss, he come out flat the next week and get beat. Third down and ten. Opportunity for the tie defense. Rodgers gets free. Can he get to the line again? Great effort to dive ahead. And with that spot, they will move the chains. A couple growing pains in a very important spot on that defense. Second and three. They go with an inside screen to Heath. Well blocked and another first down for Mississippi State. The nation most in the conference. Third and nine. Incomplete. This from 44. Right down the middle. Well struck from Reed. So Mississippi State gets on the board with a 12-play drive capped with a field goal. Third and nine. Young scrambling, and then Young is driven down by Nathaniel Watson. And it's starting to produce some real legitimate results. Rodgers. That ball is intercepted. And on the return is Battle. And you can make it a pick six. Jordan Battle. And how good does that feel for this guy? Boston College defender and somehow he got it in for the score. Rodgers. Absolutely swarmed. Myron Young. Strong and developing chemistry. They're down in five. Look at all the traffic and congestion coming in with Christian Harris smashing down Will Rogers. And Rogers is clearly banged up where the cheerleaders stand. Second and ten. Young. What accuracy while using the fleet feet. And he gets it to John Mechie for a tied first down. Third and eight. Young, over the middle, complete to Mechie again, and Mechie has been awesome in this first half as he adds to his total. A flag is down. We will check on that. He might be getting Jamison Williams with a block in the back, yeah. And now Robinson. And Robinson, the guy who had to wait his turn. Of course, Najee Harris was doing his thing. And now Brian Robinson is the man this year for the tie. Very targeted him five times tonight. He has four receptions for 87 yards. Third and four. A gap pressure. Nobody picks it up. Quick release, though, does damage to Williams and a first down. Great awareness by Bryce Young right in the face of pressure. 11th play of this drive coming. That started at their own seven-yard line. And now they're inside the 30 as Mechie 
with yet another reception. They are having a matchup problem trying to stay with John Mechie for these defenses to defend. Rayshon Holden motions into the backfield and they look his way as they swing it around. He used to do this with Devontae Smith and look at the speed of Holden inside the 10 yard line. And on third down. Out of the I formation, Robinson right in. Touchdown, tie. That's been advantage Alabama. Spot foul makes it second and 22, but he's going to launch for more than 22 downfield, and he's going to get it with Malik Heath. And just like that, still clutching his right shoulder, the Bulldogs are on the go as Heath got it over Armour Davis. Just a great throw there, giving your wide receiver a chance. So often you see young guys throwing it way too far. Man rush tests the other side and gets it complete, and that's exactly what you were talking about earlier. Second and ten, Marks on the run. Marks gets a good block, and Marks drives the legs ahead to move the chains for the Bulldogs. Looking for if I'm Will Rogers. He's the running back flanking Rogers to the right. Looks to the right, pressure up the middle, and driven down again by a completely inspired man. Will Anderson tie. This is going to be a 37 attempt for Reese. Made from 44 earlier, and he puts it through. He needs to really take the top off the defense. So expect him to continue to lean on the run game, but Mississippi State defense better be careful because the play action pass will come at some point. And walking into the box, play action off of it. Bryce Young gets the quick strike to Williams. And when Williams turns the corner, look at this. He's Gone. Jamison Williams. One play, one magical moment to start the second half. 75 yard touchdown. To put together a beautiful start. What do you say about you're going to need more than threes? A couple of field goal drives that are grinding things out. Slot receivers have to win one on ones. Short pitch to Johnson on second and three. And with that, he'll have the first down. Down. Wyatt is not a word to use often here in Stark Vegas. That will help get them going. That is Tulu Griffin. Quick strike, looking for Wally, and it's going to be first and goal Bulldogs. Then being behind the sticks. Rogers out the back of the end zone. From 37. And they cut 22 to 19. Parker, of course, who was the starting quarterback for Saban's first year on the job. It's taken down is Bryce Young by Aaron Brule. Defensively, more ways offensively than defensively, but man, it was a heck of a job by Ed Ogeron's Tigers. Will Rogers goes down again. This time it's Henry To'oto with the sack. Third and seven. Rogers goes down again. Seventh set. So good to hear that music again. Great action of the NHL. Back on this network. Bryce Young on first down. As he gets it out to Mechie. Mechie has been his favorite target. Eighth time he's looked his way. He's over 100 yards. The catch. Put a little pressure on third down. Young. Gonna run it. And he's gonna get it. And then stride out. Showing pressure. And getting it out of the backfield is Robinson. And look at him turn it on. B Rob. TD. Tied. Throughout the course of the past week. And have answered that challenge tonight against a good front. Second and three, and Williams was completely untouched. A ton of follows. Young gets it complete as he's able to connect with Holden. They drop eight against Young. He pumps and then he runs and he darts his way inside to the end zone. They said he got in. Watch at the end. Right there. 
It's a great effort from Bryce Young. Rolling on the field was a touchdown. The previous play is under further review. Let's take a look at that foot right there. That looks close. But that one yep. clearly out of bounds. Where's the ball when that right foot goes out of bounds? It's the other question, too. But The player stepped out of bounds at the one-yard line. It'll be first and goal from that spot. Second and goal. Robinson straight ahead, driving ahead and getting in for his second rushing touchdown of the night. Happens in the Power Five League Championships. Williams off right tackle, whole lot of green in front of him. And then Roy Dell Williams just absolutely blasts Richardson. Game there in November mean a little bit more. Williams dodges that one would-be tackler, another first down for Bama. Eddie, full disclosure with how they're playing right now and how things have come alive for them. And here is Bryce Young hooking it up with Holden and into the end zone. And you got a half a hundo up with the tie. What they're up against, but a team that has scratch and claw to rally to beat Louisiana Tech as this ball is going to be picked off. And it's going to be Jordan Battle again. Remember, he had the pick six earlier. So Jordan Battle is going to finish his night with two interceptions. 124 yards rushing tonight in that game. The star here was the defense with Will Anderson and the offense with that guy, Bryce Young, who threw for 348 yards and four touchdowns.